This be an auto save. Yeah, thank you. This yeah, yeah, yeah. this be an auto save. All right. This is the first Wait, is boss. That, is that the percentage of the whole game, or that that we've done so far? Eleven. That's pretty. That's pretty like good ground. Like I'm trying to remember what to do. I think this is fucking easy, mate. I'm trying to remember. <laughs> Just jump. Don't let me get in my zone. Oh, so we jump on him. Okay. Yeah. That's that's all crash, dude. Just jumping on shit. <laughs> well, he do be Mario, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's more than three times, I guess. Yeah, it is more than three times. Oh. Oh Oopsie. my! Oh, are you fucking kidding me? He had one Oopsie. hit left. Are you he fucking? He did have one left. <laughs> Fucking kidding me! It was because of the Mario jet. It made you giggle too hard. Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. That was exactly why. I love that you can see his little ass there. It's pretty hot. <laughs> it's pretty hot. It like gives you something to be to look at while you play. You know. Yeah, mate. Big billies. Hell yeah. I'm sure girl I'm sure there's a lot of girls that have like a big attraction to like big bellies, like pot bellies, you know? No no yeah, especially like uh more recently. Like not recently, but I guess since like the twenty tens and stuff, you know, like the the dad there's, bod craze has been a thing. There's been like a surge of like big What's bellies <laughs> man tits. Yeah, it's kinda bro. hot. Yeah, bro. Which I guess girls have always been attracted to big asses. Yeah, this is good for me. True. Yeah, that's technically true. Which is good for me because anytime I put on weight, 80% of it goes directly towards my ass. Does it, mate? It really do be like that. Because I've gained weight, not going to the gym and eating like a fat fucking slob, and my ass has gotten, <laughs> gotten huge, bro. Like, <laughs> it's a problem. So I'm gonna lose some weight. After I eat some Hot Pockets today, then I'll lose some weight. After you eat some Hot Pockets? Yeah, I'm gonna eat some Hot Pockets for lunch, but... Like, I started off strong. <laughs> this morning, I was eating, you know, like, eggs mm -hmm. and brown rice and grilled chicken. Which is, it was on the stove top, not on the grill, but you get mm -hmm. what I mean, like, grilled chicken. Yeah. You know, I was being good, and then I ordered some donuts and ate some donuts. And some candy. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? I want I want pizza hot pockets. <laughs> I got pizza hot pockets that I have. <laughs> Probably with some ranch dressing. I ju I'm jumping too early. I'm losing all my energy, mate. I mean, I have like equipment to exercise, like resistive bands, but uh -huh. I don't know. It's just not the same as the gym. So it's like subconsciously, you. my my body's I like, let's get fucking fat. Let's get fucking fat. <laughs> Let's turn up. Yeah. And I think it happens especially like when I feel good about myself because I just got a haircut yesterday. Uh -huh. And it's looking pretty fresh. And then like I'm like, okay, yeah, I can get fat because I look good regardless. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, my, my hair will hold up. But I guess if you eat like fucking Taco Bell every day, your hairline will recede significantly. Will it? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? The checkpoint was right there, mate. <laughs> I don't eat Taco Bell every day, by the way. I'm just saying, if you eat shittily every day, it's probably, probably, you know, not good for your hairline. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Also, when I was going vegan, it was not good for my hair because that shit was just falling out. Was it? Yeah. Interesting. It's like my body, like, genetically is like a meat eater. Because, you know, like, people are like, yeah. um, yeah, vegan's a healthy lifestyle, while it can be for, I think, you know, people have different Chip body boy. chemistries. And some things just work with others. And I've, I tried the vegan thing for a good bit, but I had, like, no energy, my hair was falling out. It's like, I don't, I don't know if this is exactly healthy, like, for me. <laughs> 
Yeah. I'm sure it works for people. Yeah. You just gotta. You just. It's just a, a trial and error thing, really, with everything. Like some workout routines can work for you. I've I've done a lot of trial and error with workout fucking shit. Some things like they say it works, and you see it work for people, but you just gotta understand your body's different from everybody else. Yeah, that's true. I've been there. But yeah, after these fucking pizza pox, I'm gonna I'm yeah. gonna be all P90X after that shit. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> I remember in the gym. I, did did they do this for you guys? Um, in the gym, they were talking about like starting P90X class when we were in high school. Did they? Yeah, for mine at least. Jesus. They Christ. never they never went with it, but went through on the idea. But yeah, they're like, yeah, we're gonna. Start doing P90X classes. I know up oh here gosh. they did a um up here. They did like a um a Zumba class one time. It should. I wish it was like a more of a. Uh, I think Zumba is more chill. If yeah. I'm mistaken. Yeah. I could be mistaken, but. I mean, it's more like a yeah. It's more dancing than it like they they trick you with the dancing, mate. Hmm. Which dancing inherently just burns a lot of fucking calories. Yeah. But your man doesn't dance. Your man doesn't dance. I'm not fucking Chris Brown. I'm not gonna <laughs> dance. No, come back. Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen that picture where they're like, this is what gamers will look like in the year 2040? No, I actually haven't. Really? <laughs> no. You, you've heard about it though, right? <laughs> I, 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 I don't think I have, mate. It was, it was like a big publication. I don't know if it was like Forbes or some shit, but it was like a, you know, respected... Well yeah. known publication. I don't know if exactly I don't know respected. Right I don't think anybody really respects publications all that much these days, but it was like this is what the gamer, the average gamer will look like in thirty years or something like that. Mm. It was like the fuck I most the fucking fuck. vile looking <laughs> like I don't know, is this really weird how they 3D modeled this this guy? <laughs> and and like Inherently, what they said was kind of racist and- Oh shit. Uh, One life left. Like, like, it was kind of racist and sexist because it was a white guy. <laughs> and it was like, you know, it was a guy, so mm -hmm. they're saying girls can be gamers. No other ethnicities play games, like... You oh, fucking shit. publications Final are a life. piece of shit, I swear. <laughs> And that's that's no meme. I, I really mean that. I hate tabloids and shit like that. But we're a tabloid, mate. We don't invest in journalism. Yeah, that's true. At least I don't want to. It was funny. I think oh, it was shit. Gus Johnson. Oh. Gus Johnson talking about a Twitter verification. Uh huh. And he was pre he was pretending to be like Twitter. And he was like going through these uh, people, and there was like, uh, the, as he went through the guys, the guys were like, I'm a YouTuber with 1 million subscribers. And it's like, nah, not you. And then, like, you know, it, it was kind of like that sort of thing. And they went through the, he went to the little kid.